Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, we know a, uh, the phases that Microsoft are going to use to release Windows 11 24H2 a little more. So we know that internally there's a build that's seen to be available for soon to be released, ARM devices. So Microsoft, for the first time, will do a two-phase release with its next Windows 11 operating system. So version 24H2, which is going to be the big update that will show up, will show up for ARM devices first. So the first release in April, probably this month, will go to manufacturers. They will be for ARM powered devices and will coincide with the release, of course, of the uh, famous uh, ARM processor, the um, Snapdragon X Elite and uh, by Qualcomm. And, of course, I think this is to show that ARM-powered devices are maybe reaching a level of efficiency and work that is good for Windows users. So that will be the first phase. Then, of course, will be the Intel phase or the X, e, X64 phase where AMD and Intel processors will get it. That will be, of course, for most of us on our computers, September or October. But even that's going to be in two phases. There will be a release to AI-capable computers before. So any computer that has an NPU that will be capable of running AI features of Copilot and all the uh, artificial intelligence features included within Windows will be the first to get it. And then the last to get it will be the standard PCs like we have. They'll get 24H2. And it will be missing features that are AI-driven only, apparently. So there are things that are going to show up on the uh, ARM devices and on the uh, devices with NPUs that will not be showing up on the standard 24H2 for the regular PCs that don't have neural processing units for AI. So this is going to be interesting to see um, what's missing, but uh, it's probably one of the first times that I see uh, Microsoft doing different phases for different processors within the um, Windows 11 and Windows operating system update anyways. So it's a big update coming up, and it will be done in uh, several phases, uh, with ARM processors being the first ones. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.